Yikes. Here we are again. Tales of trails. Places been. When all my travels. And sometimes against my better judgment. I'd get myself forced into some pretty dumb situations. Yeah, I don't like to travel on the highways and byways. I like the dirt and gravel roads. You know those old roads that used to be the highways from here to there, north to south and east to west, before Ike bought, well, he built all them cement highways. We call them the interstate system now. With stretches on them long enough as a mile, like a airport runway for military jets to land, just in case. There's a method and a madness to everything. Well, I was halfway there to wherever it was, headed south. Another winter coming before it blows. In me old pickup, it didn't have no heater or no radio. I just sing to myself along the way, cause back then, those were optional items, you know. And if a vehicle came from down south, it wouldn't have no heater anyway, one needed. Well, it was too cold that night to sleep in the cab, so I stopped at this old tumbled down shack of a motel. Like I said, backwoods kind of thing. And I laid down a saw buck to the night clerk to sleep on a moldy old flea infested mattress. I couldn't get to sleep. Try as I might, there was a tap, a drinking, uh, dripping rather, in the sink. Or the sink was a drinking from the tap. And it just kept a dripping, and well. Finally, I got up and called the night clerk, and I said, I said, sorry to bother you, but I got a leak in the sink. And the night clerk replied, heck, that's okay. Just make sure you run that tap a bit for a minute or two when you're done. Woohoo! 